Hey guys, so today I'm gonna be showing you guys some NCT Dream concert outfit ideas. I am aware that their tour started a while ago and that literally as I'm filming this video, their first US concert is today. I kind of lost track of time because I did want to film this video like before their tour started. I didn't realize it came so fast. I know they still have the rest of their tour. So I hope that anyone watching this can get some inspiration or some ideas for what to wear. I especially really love NCT CT concerts because everyone it's just the majority of people are wearing green and green is one of my favorite colors So it's just like a bunch of grass because NCT's color is like a neon very neon green So I'm really excited to see what everyone wears what all my mutuals all my friends wear to their concerts Everyone's gonna look so freaking good. I already know. I just want to make a disclaimer Definitely don't worry too much about what you wear I know sometimes people may tend to feel bad because they're not dressed up like other people are or they feel underdressed Please don't feel that way dress how you want to dress don't feel pressure to dress a certain way because other you see someone else wearing that but for sure if you want to try something new if you want to wear something out of your comfort zone definitely i'd say do it i think k-pop concerts are like the perfect day for you to do that for you to try something new put together a few outfits i don't know how many because i was just kind of like making a bunch and seeing what goes well with each other let's see the fits let's see the fits guys if i'm looking to the corner i have like the picture on my phone so this first one this top i actually wore to 127's show last year and it's a very flowy green tank top and it kind of reminds me of Tinkerbell I know when I wore it people were saying like Tinkerbell fairy vibes and I found it on Depop it's so cute it's so flattering and I just paired it with these low-waisted corduroy ivory pants that I got from Urban Outfitters and then I wore my Doc Martens and this green purse that I found at a flea market a solid green and white outfit is a good way to go obviously you don't have to wear green to the concert but I feel like it's just kind of like a thing that a lot of in citizens do to their concerts is they wear some sort of green and i know green can be very hard to match the average person doesn't really own green or specifically like that neon kind of green if you don't really like the neon green that nct's color is because i know it's a very out there color i know when i first saw nct i was kind of shy to wear green because i was like oh my gosh no one's gonna wear green not a lot of people wore green because i feel like it wasn't really a thing back then when i first saw them but now everyone wears green i know it can be a very scary color to wear or you might be scared that you can't match it very well but i promise you everyone's gonna be looking like grass and it's gonna be a very fun time okay this next outfit which i really freaking like but i'm wearing this green puffer vest that i got from urban outfitters it's my favorite puffer vest ever i love it so so bad and the reason why i got it was because of nct because it reminded me so much of them but i just paired it with like a white t-shirt underneath or depending if you're gonna be in a much colder area you could wear a white long sleeve under Underneath. And then I paired it with these cargo pants that I also got from Urban Outfitters. These are really comfy actually. I think they're really flattering on me too and they fit a bit low-waisted but not super low-waisted to the point where it's like uncomfortable. I'm just wearing my Nikes, my Jester Nikes. They're my favorite shoes ever. I love them so much. I remember wearing this puffer and someone mentioned how it reminded them of, was it glitch mode? Concept where they're wearing puffer. Or I know Mark is wearing a puffer vest and they're just wearing like very bright colorful clothing. No, no, beatbox it was beatbox my bad i think beatbox's uh concept pictures they have very cute outfits that you guys can recreate i would say this one is one of my favorites i think the green really pops and i feel like it gives very much nct dream in my opinion from all the outfits that i've seen so far i've seen a lot of similarities to this one like a lot of people wearing like puffer jackets puffer vests and i feel like it, it's very nct dream vibes like for some reason i just think of like puffer stuff or like fuzzy stuff or hella bright colors whenever i think of nct dream this next outfit is more pastel like kind of picnic like I'd say I'm wearing these gingham checkerboard green and white pants. I got these from vergegirl.com, I believe. They're really comfy. They have like a stretchy waist, so it's not super tight. I'm just pairing it with my Nikes. This super white, almost doll look kind of top that I got from Urban Outfitters. It's really cute. I like how you can see your tummy in the middle, like it kind of splits. This outfit reminds me of like as if I'm going on a picnic. You know, I'm wearing green, I'm representing. If you guys have any green pants or any green bottoms, just wear some something white and you'll be good. 
you'll be good. When I wore this outfit, I felt very girly, very like, I'm going to brunch. I'm going to like drink some tea with like my besties. I didn't get a chance to include it in this video for the outfits, but pink and green go very well together. Also because it reminds me of watermelon. So like if you're marked biased or even if you're not marked biased, you can wear a combination of pink and green or red and green. I don't know. Every time I think of NCT Dream, I just think of like pastel colors, like very random colors combined with each other. If you see like their concepts of all their pastel comebacks i feel like they're just a very colorful group they're wearing two completely different colors but it goes well also orange and green which maybe might make you look like an orange but i'm pretty sure it was either jenna or chunla who wore orange and green for beatbox i'm pretty pretty sure if you guys have a bunch of color in your closet i definitely think you guys should experiment and just combine a bunch of different colors and pieces together it might be scary to wear a lot of color especially if you're used to wearing just all black or just neutral colors but if you do want to try a much more colorful palette for the concert i definitely think you guys should try that out with all of these outfits i tried my best to include outfits that are more reserved so not showing a lot of skin but then also some outfits that are a little bit more showy obviously wear what you're comfortable with depending what you guys are much more comfortable with i hope you guys can get some inspiration from either side but this one this next one is definitely showing a lot of skin but i when i tried it on i literally i had to stop filming and i was like hold on and I like took some pictures. So it's this army green off the shoulder top that I got from PacSun. And then I'm wearing an army green denim mini skirt with a built-in belt that I got from Urban Outfitters. Black knee-high boots that I got from Steve Madden. This one is such a good one. Like this one's so freaking good. I don't know. I'm like obsessed with it. Army green is a good alternative if you want a much more like low-key, not super bright, but you're also still wearing green. So like for this, you know, I'm decked out in green. It's not as bright because it's a much more like doled down and muted green but yeah this one is definitely one of my favorites too like i want to wear this out dude like this is such a good ugh, i just i couldn't believe who i was looking in the mirror when i was recording i was like oh my god I was like, who is that? I'm doing GA for Seattle, so I don't want to wear something super uncomfortable. Like, I don't want to wear heels or else I would wear this. If NCT Dream had come to the Bay, or actually if I just had seated seats in general, like assigned seats in general, I would wear something a lot more like this, I'd feel like. But since I am going to be lining up all day, I'm planning on wearing something a little bit more comfortable, but also still on the showy side, I guess. I would totally wear this, but unfortunately I'm not. Maybe next time, okay? And then obviously with all of these outfits, you need to make sure that you're not going to be freezing outside. I know sometimes sweaters can ruin the outfits and I'm a victim. I don't think it's victim, but I'm a person that will not wear a sweater if it ruins my outfit. Like I will rather freeze because the sweater does ruin the outfit. It really does. You know, if you're wearing a much showier outfit like this and you have a leather jacket, I recommend wearing the leather jacket. So here I paired this leather blazer jacket that I got from Urban Outfitters 2 and it matches with the black boots. So now it looks like I'm like about to solve a crime or about to go like rob a bank hot version but I don't get caught because that would be embarrassing you know this next outfit is kind of similar to the last one it's a little more showy too not as showy I'd say it's again this black and green color combination so instead of wearing a green top and bottom I'm wearing black top and bottom but then wearing a green jacket so it's like reversed so i'm just wearing this black roughly top that i got from urban this super comfortable skirt from urban i know everything's from urban i'm sorry it's a skirt but it has built-in shorts so literally you could be doing the splits and you like won't flash anyone and they're super comfortable especially for concerts like i always recommend people to get this skirt like i've had friends who are like thinking about getting the skirt i'm like dude get it because it's super super comfortable and i don't feel as like uncomfortable wearing this skirt because there's like built-in shorts you know my junk isn't i don't even have junk <laughs> Like my stuff isn't showing. I'm wearing the same boots from Steve Madden. And then this green, oh, it's so cute. This green corduroy jacket that I actually bought from someone that I follow on Instagram. They were selling their clothes and I was like, I need that one. But it's such a pretty jacket. I'm actually thinking of wearing this to the concert, but with like a different kind of vibe because I haven't worn it out yet. And I feel like it fits perfectly. And then I paired it off with this cute ship hat. I don't know what this is called. It's a Harley Davidson hat and it's like a captain hat. I got it at a flea market you know it looks like i'm gonna go drive a ship i don't think it's 
driving row a ship it looks like i'm a captain and that's all that matters so if you guys have any cute hats like that any cute bucket hats captain hats like this berets berets are really cute because we know nct dream always wears berets and i always freaking die this next outfit is a little bit more on the comfier side these green very loose green pants they're actually men's pants that i got from urban outfitters and they fit really loose they're super comfortable and they fit low-waisted because men's in general i think men's pants are low-waisted i don't think they have high-waisted stuff and then i paired it with this very cute white tank top that says angel on it and i'm wearing my usual nikes and i have some white sunglasses on my head to match the white top and the white shoes if you guys have some funky green pants some crazy green patterned pants some very baggy pants doesn't necessarily have to be green but if you guys own like any baggy stuff because you want to try that more baggy look for the concert i think that's a good way to go you know if you want to feel more comfortable this goes for like anyone okay even if you don't like nct and you don't like the color green like whatever but i feel like everyone should own green pants especially this shade of green is so good it's such a good shade of green what i hate is that this is men's pants because i can never find this specific shade of green in women's pants for women's pants it's always some like weird shade of green and i'm just like dude like i can't if you guys ever want to like try some crazy colored pants go with green i promise you will like it and it'll make you feel down to earth because it's green and you like mother nature and you like the planet this next outfit is a little bit more like doll look kind of girly cottage core but i'm wearing this very cute long sleeve and it has a square neck i love square neck tops i think they're super flattering on me i think it's a good change in compared to like just the curved or like v-neck i don't like v-neck this top is from urban outfitters and this is my favorite shade of green it's like a matcha sage green so again if you guys don't want to wear the neon green or some super bright green color i think a matcha color green or a sage green is a good alternative i'm pairing it with this denim skirt that i thrifted and then some white long socks with my mary janes if you want to go for that doll look i definitely recommend getting mary janes they're super super cute every time i wear them i feel like a little doll like a little creepy doll haunted doll especially if i'm wearing braids i just feel like i'm haunting the planet yeah i love this outfit what the heck like i i cannot wait for summer because i'm gonna be wearing all these outfits like i'm so ready okay i'm ready like if you don't want to wear denim jeans and you want to try something different denim skirts are a cute alternative you could even put your hair in little braids add some little bows i just bought these bows from urban and they're like a cute lace look at that look at it oh my god yes do it right now this next outfit is a good standard i think wearing a t-shirt of nct dream or like of the concert you're going to and then pairing it with some baggy jeans and just some sneakers is such a good way to go it's the most comfortable outfit you could ever wear too like not only are you representing the group on t-shirt but you're also going to be comfy comfy enough to jump and scream and sing and stuff so i'm wearing this mark t-shirt one of my friends from tiktok made i think this has been like a recent thing but you know like those shirts that says i love new york and it says i and the heart and then ny i've seen some custom made ones from i'm assuming they bought from etsy where it says i love jeno or i love chanla or jisung i remember seeing two friends at the p1 harmony show they each had one and they were matching so one of them said like i love theo and the other one said i love jiu or something like that those are really cute too just like a simple t-shirt it's like a funny conversation starter definitely don't stress too much about what you're gonna wear because at the end of the day you're gonna go there to see your favorite artist and don't feel bad if you feel like you're underdressed or that you don't fit in with what everyone else is wearing trust me no one is gonna judge what you're wearing no one is gonna care that you're wearing a t-shirt you're wearing a skirt that you're full-on decked out in green if this is your first concert don't worry too much about any of that when fans dress up they're dressing up for themselves and then this next outfit is an alternative for if you do want to wear like a k-pop shirt but you want to be a little bit more girly so i'm wearing this very cute hello feature t-shirt that I got like two years ago. I don't remember where I got it. I don't think the seller makes it anymore. I just paired it with this green lime skirt, which is the same skirt as the black one that I was talking about earlier, but it's like the green version. And this is like a velvet material, so it's super soft. I tied the shirt from the back to make it a little bit more cropped or you could let it down too if you don't want to show your tummy and then i'm wearing these white long socks and then i paired it with these cute 
platform sandals that I got from Forever 21. Okay, I was super surprised when I saw these at Forever 21. I was like, whoa. I think the whole look of socks with sandals, like chunky sandals, platform sandals like these are really cute. It's such a cute way to like up your outfit. It goes well with jeans. It goes well with skirts, denim skirts, long skirts, maxi midi skirts. Like it's such a cute vibe in my opinion. Like I love that whole look. I know before it was like a controversial thing that like you shouldn't wear socks with heels or socks with sandals because it's like weird or whatever. Not all of us want to show our toes, okay? Not all of us want to let the dogs out. Like literally NCT do in every freaking picture that they post on Instagram, okay? chill but that is basically all of the outfits that i have for you guys hopefully you guys got some inspiration i can't wait to see what everyone wears to the concert i'm definitely gonna take so much inspiration from everyone else i just love seeing people wear green okay that's the most thing i'm excited about wear what you want to wear wear what you're comfortable with and just have a great time okay hope that if you guys are seeing nct dream soon that you guys have an amazing and amazing time i'm super excited to see them too don't forget to follow me on my social media i'm gonna be going to their seattle date i'm gonna be posting a lot about that on my instagram and obviously i'm gonna be vlogging that too but if you guys want to keep up on how that trip goes definitely follow me on instagram because i'll be posting a lot on there okay and i'm gonna be there for literally a week so don't forget to be careful at concerts if you're going alone or if you're going with friends be aware of your surroundings make sure someone knows your location make sure your phone is always on make sure you're drinking water make sure you're eating don't forget to have a great time I'm so nervous. I'm scared. Okay, stay safe you guys and I will see you in my next video.